Well, hi. Well, so what, have you ever been fishing? Me? Yes. I've yes, been. you have been. Well, I've only ever been fishing once, and I didn't catch anything. It was off the Ventura County Pier, and actually, I got a bee sting. So it wasn't like the best experience of fishing. But my nephew, Andrew, he loves to fish. So usually when he goes fishing, he uses like a rod and a reel and a line and he casts it out. But you know what sometimes he uses when he goes fishing? You're looking already, you know he uses a net. He uses a fishing net. Yeah. Now, this is also not this kind of net, but you know, in Jesus' time, they used a net too. They didn't have the fishing rod and we likely do today. They used a net. So what do you think it takes to be a good fisherman or fisherwoman? What do you think it, what do you think it takes? You probably, well, you need the right equipment, right? So a net, practice. You're so right. It takes practice. That's just about how to be successful in anything, right? It takes practice. Yeah. You kind of got to go where the fish are, right? Um, so a lake or the sea, you can't really just go out in the desert and, and fish. Generally, generally doesn't work. Mm, and maybe also patience. Yeah. So you got to be in the right place. You got to be where the fish are. You got to have the right equipment. You got to have patience. You got to practice. Yeah. Well, so today in our gospel reading, Jesus calls the disciples to fish for people. Now, do you mind if I use, uh, Spencer, do you mind if I use you as a demonstration for this? Do you think that Jesus means, when he says to fish for people, that he means for us to do that? No, probably, probably not. <laughs> so what do we think he means when we, to fish for people? Did Miss Molly talk to you about that in, our, in the yeah. Sunday school? Yeah. Is it like tell people about Jesus? Yeah. And like show people the love of Jesus? And what do we need to do that? Kind of some of the same things, right? Like the tools would be like being in church and knowing scripture and, and showing the love of Jesus and practice. We need practice. We need to do it. The more we do it, the better we'll get at it, right? And we need to be where the fish are. Like, we got to go where the people are who need to hear about Jesus, right? Mm -hmm. And also patience. We need patience because sometimes we tell people and they don't respond, but we keep telling them, and then sometimes they do. Sometimes we catch them for Jesus. Make sense? Okay. Well, thank you all for coming up. And what is his name now that I... Finn. 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 And welcome to Finn as well. <laughs> can, you guys, can you guys pray with me? Yeah. Yeah? Okay, let's pray. Lord God, we're so grateful that you have called us to fish for people by telling people about Jesus and showing people the love of Jesus and how we live our lives every day. Help us to shine with his light and to catch people for you. And all this we pray in Jesus' name. Amen.